<laughs> One lean. Do I have to wait for him to put the VODs up before I can watch the streams, man? Um, on my channel, I'm pretty sure the stream's straight up as soon as the stream finishes. You can go in and watch it straight back. <laughs> Prepare for battle. Prepare to fight! Uh, Hero-wise, it looks like both teams have basically got the, the identical set of what they just had. Um, Blame and Leas are all a lot of pikes for the... in A. They got That's a lot of Reapers out as well. Blame and Leas, keep them Reapers out. It looks like they're actually going to fight for the walls. Mm -hmm. Six sets, seven sets of Reapers out. They got Banner Guards as well, a set of Namcans. Them Namcans will do work when, I, when we were fighting that. Uh, looking at it from defender point of view, the left tower they just didn't do a push at first because the Namcans were just raining down on them. From from the bottom resupply as we're looking at yeah, it. Yeah, like, yeah, from yeah. that resupply just shooting yeah. up onto the, the first tower here. Yeah. They just didn't push because there was just that much bleed. That's why normally when a push comes in on this, it, it normally comes from the middle tower. Yeah. If they want to go on the way. Slide, save the cap for the next CB rivals. Let's go, Slut Sentra. Defend B, the <laughs> fuck? That's, I mean, that's exactly what I was thinking, man. That was fucking... I mean, it was, it was something different. I was, like, happy that it was something different, but I wouldn't have chosen to do it that way. <laughs> and thank you for the follow, Sheen Guard. Much appreciated, my dude. Right. Pretty sure there wasn't a Sally outgoing. Who's Shane Guard? He's just some shit German, isn't he? I'm pretty sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, Ugarai Turbo Carry. What's <laughs> up, girls? I gave that Shane Guard a 10 years to this. Because he was crying in my DMs. Crying in my DMs. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone enjoyed oh, that. Is that, uh, is that all that it takes to get beat. some money from you? Mm. Right, I'm going to start crying in his DMs. <laughs> <laughs> Next week it's Arbor City, by the way. Arbor City. Mm. All right, yeah. That's that could be interesting as well, man. I don't reckon anyone will defend A. Falconer is a, a standard ban on that. Yeah, because if you if you was, you <laughs> could just play towers and time. Uh, Harbor City is the fucking the side gate on the. There's like one long straight wall. You got the side gate. Oh, like if, if you're looking at like this, cool. and it's got the side gate over here, and then the main gate, and A is just above it, and then it's just the end point. Yeah, because you normally <laughs> take A, then you go for that right supply as attackers, don't you? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. I reckon yeah. what'll happen though is they'll just ignore A and fight the, the the first line behind the wall on Harbor City. Maybe a strat. There's a couple of places you can do it with avenues though, where you like Treb safe. But I don't think they'll do much to defend A, actually. Because you get, like, defend, loads of times on that map, don't you, to get A? And if you let A go, you can just defend bottom and stairs, can't you? This, yeah. Uh, gate and stairs. You only have to be careful that nothing comes through, like, the back um, the back gate. Yeah, back entrance, yeah. So blame at least they're doing a full A defense. <laughs> the, the way to counter this for surfs, though, is, is just go up that far tower and go for B. It's quite easy for him to rotate, though. Yeah, I know, but, like, you can't trebe. But if you can pull them along the wall or to B, mm -hmm. there's there's mm -hmm. places where you can, like, stop them and treb them. Especially if they get the gate down and they can get, like, cavin and shit if the uh, Ugarai there moves it stuff out of the way. Which is probably not going to be stupid enough to do. That's the thing. I didn't see many trebs from us on attack, either. Ugarai's literally just looking at it going, Come at me, bros. Come mm. on, dare you. Oh, now he's done. I fuck this. I'm out. I'm out. There's too many. <laughs> nah, fuck that. Guy. Fuck that, boys. Mistakes were made. Let's go. Yes, yeah, so they're gonna go up the middle tower. Nothing's on this back tower. The Namcam's on the supply point. No, where are the Namcam? Or did they get rid of them? Yeah, okay, they they got rid of them. They got rid. Of them. We'll skip there. Is that dark flames up on the top? Just bombing, <laughs> bombing the point. That was Thurs going to deal with this then. Doing for gate push? No. Not doing out at the minute, are they? I think they are going to go gate though. Go gate and B maybe? This this down here isn't going to stop anything coming through the gate though. If they'd have had Fort Abracchio possibly. Yeah, they're going for gate, aren't they? Oh no, they're probably baiting them off at wall and they're going to rotate, bait, rotate back to that uh, tower. 
That's just by eating them. Blame Elias, they're doing the right thing though, they're not really overreacting to anything. They could easily oh, just go a, for B now. It's quite a close quartered map, so you... you know, they're pushing through now though, through, they've blocked them off. No, we're... Elias are responding very well though. This fight is going to be rough, Elias are going to lose that. These, They're already pushing in though, these need to get in there as quickly as they can. They're completely pinched as well. Oof, Flamers are up. Rough man. Couple more surf players coming through the back though. Looks like Uruguay is going to get a new unit. Did the defenders not have a cavalry? Oh, surf players absolutely ruined there. They got absolutely shredded. I thought the defenders just had flames out. I swear I got I just saw flames in that fight. Clearly not. But the defenders just lost 110 and the attackers just lost 300 units. Like, oh. Was that attacking flames that we just used then? I swear to god there was flames sure. coming in. Like when when um surf slaves were here, there was like a flame coming in from behind them. Unless they died and they'd already started swapping out the units. But Chocolate Paladins beat Triarchy. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Soul just killed Rockstar as well. I don't even know where that went down. Where's Soul? Was it Soul's unit? Like, I literally didn't even see what happened in there. Unless that's like a delay from the big fight that just happened down at the bottom here. Uh, maybe. But playing tucked on the A like that, it's just so hard to break. Yeah. And they're gonna counter push now on this one side by the looks of it, or at least just make it make them think that they are. The difference is now though, if uh Surf Slay is pushing, they're the ones pinching from both sides. Very good counter there though. They're like all Iron Reapers. Iron Reapers and Palace Guards are gonna do work. The attackers already dropped one dude. Ooh, saying that the defenders just dropped two heroes. That Treb could be huge. Or just hit their own stuff. That was actually pretty decent. That was actually very decent, Treb. Jackie Trin's been able to get down on this side with Dark Flames, Flare Star, Kara, and OP as well. Um, the defenders might be able to rotate into that though. Although the defenders are only down to nine. We serve the Emperor. Very strong push from the attackers there. I'm gonna go this side so we can see what's getting. The attackers are actually putting pressure on the resupply so the defenders can't get used to them. Which very good shout. Preemptive Treb on the back stairs here to stop resupply coming in. I think the second two. I'll send that there's too much cavalry out, isn't there? Is that going to be a. Uh... Yeah. There's only three heroes on that point. Mm -hmm. Nerf Slay's about to pull back now. Look, they've, they've, they took too long. Mr. Tok is going to go out. I wouldn't be surprised if Tok goes out now. That Treb's, that Treb's, that Treb's not going to hit at all. Yeah, there he goes. There goes Tok. Now we'll get an eye on this. Not, no actual fighting going up. Oh, no, no. Oh. He's like, oh, did he get caught out? Lucky. Cataphracts would have ruined them armigas there. Mr. Tip, Mr. Tok on the ball, though. Seeing it, was like, nah, nah, boys, I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> Good fight so far, though. Only three more minutes, though. So Surf Slays are going to have to do something. Miss Jack just killed Zet. Did not see where that went down. Well, they got a mini cap off on B as well. Try to get an angle to see what these guys are going to do. Obviously, the attackers have got a unit or two of cav up now as well, so they're going to have to go through the gate with some stuff. Um, Elias know that, and they've got Fort Brachio down two sets in loose formation with Modal. Uh, so good luck getting through there, boys. So they're also building up on both towers again. They've got the units, but they've they've got time for maybe one push. Are they rotating to B? Hmm? Or is it a bait rotating? I think it's just to get their uh, jabs off on the fortas that are at the bottom of the stairs there. See if so, yeah, surf's coming now. Yeah, from both sides. We could do, we could do a pinch. And they're pushing through with cat. They're going through with cat. 
uh, IPGs to get rid of them. Uh, and now, because they're IPG and the cap can get through and wipe shit, they might go for B. If these were the cap, should go B. They've got pressure upon A. It looks like they're slowly winning the fight up there, or it's at least to a standstill. The two guys with cap should be going for B, really. They've got two minutes left of time. And Ugarai with his cav again is going to absolutely shrek these IPGs. They've used their walk already. They're not looking the right way to break. He might get them on the stairs, though. Oh, no. Too late. I think it's Blame Elias' game, man. Yeah. 2-0. That was very similar to ours when um, Slabs were defending. Ugarai with his cab back here as well. Look, putting pressure upon the IPGs. If he, he can just get in, man. He, he probably doesn't know that they don't have a walk. There we go. They just cleared that. Got Jackie Trin coming in with his cab though, that's going to do work. That is going to be an awesome charge. Although it got stopped by uh, Imperator, the Polax. Did his lock up a strikes and stopped most of that there. Good try from Jackie Trin though. Blair Star coming in with his cab. Mr. Pop got a quad kill. Yeah, it's GG. Blame Elias. 2 0. Very good games. The cohesion of Blame Elias is so good, man. It's what, I, you know, it's, it's, don't get me wrong, it's great to have great individual players, but if you've got a 15 man that moves as a 15 man. Yeah. That was, I mean, it's not like Blame Elias have got bad players, they've definitely got good players. Um, it's just the, there's definitely names on Surf Slayer's team that most players know. <laughs> yeah. Just from like, just. Like Jackie Trin for one of them. Dark Flames is another one that where just like there's just there's just names on Surf Slayer's team where everyone knows that they're they're very strong players. But Blame Elias is a very strong team. And I mean, look at some of the guys. Thirty seconds. Look at this. They're just clearing. Oh. Um, fifteen hero deaths to forty-one. Massive units. They killed like three hundred more. That's size what. All uh, Lama the Cray, 111 units, Stole 109. Uh, Stole with 7 heroes as well, Lazy Imperator as well with 7 heroes. Blood Story, 112 units. Brutal, man. Uruguay, 8 as well. Why do I say Uruguay over Uruguay? Good fight, man. Who is streaming now? No one. Mm. Uh, I would have liked to have done Pond Guard against... Um, uh, Pond Guard against Jack, but... Um, Delgius, Delgius is covering that. So, GG, Blame Elias, 2 0. Very good matchups. I'm going to DM that quick. <laughs> Blame Elias, there, man. They, they had they had pretty much control of that in every engagement. There's like one point where it looked like Surf Slayers might actually get the A point, um, but they didn't have the, the units there. <laughs> And hero killing power basically to clear off the point. And then the least could just get the reinforcements back in quick enough to stop them. Yep. That's what I mean. Like it's, it is it is a very, very small rotation map. So if you play very close like they did, they use that supply point through A as, as a massive, massive part of their strength.